Hong Kong might be lifting its mask mandate on March the 1st, but many residents say they'll keep wearing them, even outdoors. We will all continue to wear face masks. We will, because we are afraid that the virus will come back. I want to protect myself and my family. It's not a good thing if my family gets infected, even though the symptoms are mild. I think the government is really at a loss and I have no idea what they're doing. I'm getting old, so I'll wear a mask when I'm taking public transport. I don't feel it's safe in crowded places, don't you think? Do you feel safe? I don't. Residents have been subject to stringent coronavirus restrictions since 2020. It'll take some time for them to get used to what life was like before the pandemic. But officials are hoping that with the lifting of this last major COVID rule, normalcy will be quickly restored so that people will start returning to the Chinese hub as the Hello Hong Kong campaign is promoted. After looking at all the data, the trend and the fact that the winter surge uh, is nearing the end, in order to give people a very clear message that Hong Kong is resuming normalcy. I think this is the right time to make this decision. Hong Kong did start to unwind strict COVID rules last year, but mask wearing has remained constant since 2020, with children as young as two required to wear masks outside their homes and students required to do a daily rat test. But that will be scrapped too from March the 1st for older students and March the 15th for primary schools and nurseries. Nearby Macau, which has also followed China's zero COVID policy for much of the past three years, is now relaxing mask requirements. Already on the mainland, residents don't have to wear masks outdoors. Yvonne Yong, ABC News.